Any questions? Kevin. Just some of the adjustments you guys made. You got a quick goal early, but then you guys continue to keep falling down. Just one thing you guys been addressing about not getting down early. Yeah, absolutely. I think uh, we got to realize that it's a game of runs, and you know, even last night we were down four out and start the game and battle back. So we got to realize that they score early or score a couple early. That you know, long game and got a long way to go. And I think uh, both ends of the floor, offensively and defensively, we answered the bell when, when it was necessary. You never getting discouraged and stuff and staying positive. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I think that might have been a problem the past couple weekends. We were down by a handful and. Uh, Kind of, you know, the ship was sinking, and it was kind of got to the point where it was too late, and, and we got down on each other and down as a team. But uh, having a couple of weeks off, and usually, you know, you don't have to buy a week after a loss, but after kind of a skid like that, it was nice to sort of, you know, hit the restart button, kind of refocus ourselves, get a different mindset, and uh, really stay positive and realize that uh, it's a 60-minute game, and it doesn't matter if you're lo losing in the first quarter. It's just what happens again in the game. How do you feel physically after back to back game? Uh, right now I'm okay. I think tomorrow morning's going to be kind of tough to get out of bed, but uh, you know that's part of the NLL and part of what we signed up for, and uh, it's it's part of our job to prepare during the week for for this kind of situation. So maybe you know, when you're when you're going to the gym and going for runs and things and preparing for a week, maybe uh, on a week where you have a back to back, you sort of you edge it back a little bit so that you've got some some juice left in the tank for for that second game. A little bit easier approach the second game after a back to back after you won the night before. Um, I think so. I mean, when you want to go back to back, usually you're, you're trying to come out the week of the split, but uh, that really wasn't what we were trying to do. We, you know, it's easy to say we wanted the sweep, but we really, after uh, after those past, past two games, we really wanted, needed the sweep. So that was our mentality. So uh, we, last night, getting a win was really a big confidence boost for us against a good Rochester team who absolutely dominated us. And to realize, hey, we can play at this level too, it was it was helpful coming into the day. It just gave us a lot more confidence. I just sort of alluded to my question, how big of it is to finally get that Rochester monkey off your back, so to speak? Oh, absolutely. I mean, uh, they're a talented team. They have been for years, and uh, it's my first year with Philly, but from what I've, I've read, they've kind of had a hard number the past, past little while. So I know that was an important win for our, for our franchise and for our team going forward. We see them again in a couple of weeks, and we can most likely see them again in the playoffs. So to, to get that monkey off our back and to know that we can, we can get a win off of them, um, that's huge for our conference down the stretch. More questions for Kevin?